Hello, my name is Brandon Heaslip from Colorfront. We're at the Renaissance Hotel for NAB 2019, and we're gonna show you a couple of things that we're launching this year. Uh, one is the new version of EXD and OSD 2019, which allows you to, to, to do simultaneous uh, HDR and SDR dailies uh, with two independent color pipelines uh, to show the idea that you can do HDR dailies just as easily as you can with SDR, as long as you have the right tools in place. So currently we have uh, EXD open and we have a beautiful image uh, from a Venice camera of Las Vegas. And we have uh, two outputs. One is a 709 output and one is a PQ uh, 1000 nit output. And the idea behind it is your editorial staff may be in Rec 709, uh, standard def or, or HD uh, in, in limited color space for Rec 709, but you're Producers want to see everything in HDR on their iPads at 600 nits because that's what the iPad can do. And you can actually set up separate deliverables to create those simultaneously without having to reset up a project or do a different output. We also have uh, the AJA and Colorfront Analyzer. Uh, there's an update to it this year uh, with a couple new features. One is the average knit level uh, and the peak knit level. Uh, you can see it all at the same time. And we also have uh, the, the gamma reading to tell you if you're in the correct color spaces. Uh, this is coming in uh, in June, as well as uh, EXD OSD will be launching uh, you know, later this year. We're hoping for a uh, early to mid summer release for EXD and OSD 2019. And one of the next things that we will do uh, that we're showing this year is Transcoder 2019, who's the industry leader for transcoding and making IMF mezzanine deliverables uh, for Netflix and Amazon uh, and all the other major studios. Uh, the big push this year is IAB or Dolby Atmos. Uh, we now have the ability to take a ADM WAV file, bring it into Transcoder, and you can actually see all 36 or 128 or however many different channels you might have in that mix down uh, in the timeline. You can solo the channels out so you can actually hear and do proper QC of the audio, uh, whether you're in a two channel setup like we are here today or in a 7.14 uh, completely uh, done in mixed room. You can actually change what you see and what you hear uh, on the QC side. We've also uh, rebuilt our subtitle engine, uh, which will uh, support IMSC 1.1, as well as Cine Canvas for DCP uh, checking. So the idea is uh, you will no longer have to go to a theater to check your DCP subtitling because we can match what an, uh, a media block inside a, a cinema will actually do. Uh, so you can actually replicate that in a QC bay without taking up the, the time uh, or the money spent for the uh, theaters that you have uh, and use the, the theaters for what they need to be used for. Um, and that's what's uh, new and quick uh, for Transcoder and Colorfront and EXD and OSD uh, 2019. And uh, we hope you guys enjoy the show.